this is Kid JFJ signing in. I highly appreciate every single one of you guys returning back to my channel. With that said, you guys are beautiful and amazing. All right, you guys, you're probably like, whoa, what does he have right there today in the setup, man? What's going on today? Well, today I'm gonna introduce you to the tiniest, smallest robot out there embedded in this world. Today is an entertaining video, you guys. It's gonna be amazing. I'm so motivated and so happy to actually make this video because I can't wait to start playing with it. But first of all, I gotta show you guys what you guys will need and of course, the introduction to it. So this is Ozobot right here. This is the tiniest and smallest robot invented out there in this world. As you guys can see, it looks like the robot from Star Wars, but it ain't. It is Azobot. As we're still in this quarantine, even my guinea pigs got me tired already. Now I'm joking, you guys. They're still cute and wonderful. So even my chicken pig got me bored already. So with that, fly away, chicken. So things you'll need for this bad boy to work, I'm gonna show you guys right now. I'm gonna show you guys how to make some cool playgrounds, and I'm gonna show you guys um some color coding that the robot can read. And um, you can use print white paper, or as I'm having fun with it, I'm using this roll paper right here. So yep, I'm pretty much have a white roll paper because I've been having a blast with this little robot right here, as you guys can see. So um, let's, I'm gonna show you guys what comes in this little packet. What comes in this little packet is the instructions. You could actually um have a characterize your your little um Ozobot. I'm gonna characterize mine as a chicken. Um, things that comes in this little packet is the starter pack. The way you turn this little Ozobot, on the left side, it has a power button, so you press on it, the light should start turning on, and it's looking for something to read. As you guys see, it's ready to go. But you guys are gonna have to tune it up. It's tuning up, and when it's done, just pick it up. So I'm gonna show you what else it comes with. Some cool stickers, Ozobot. We have some tracks right here that we could use, but I'm, we're gonna actually make ours we're gonna make our own this right here is the color coding it could go left go straight it can spin it can do tornado spin i'm gonna show you guys how to make these color codes within a white sheet of paper so with that um, i'll see you guys in the setup Boop, there you go you guys i transformed them into a chicken this is my ozobot as you guys can see so we're gonna put it here and as you guys can see and witness that i already laid out the um, platform for it we're gonna build a bigger and better playground for it so you guys could witness it all right so we're gonna get started then we're gonna put a code we're gonna make him do the tornado spin so you guys can see the tornado spin is right here this is the color coding for the tornado spin then we're gonna have him do a nitro boost I can't wait for it. This one's a color code for the Nitro Boost right there. So let's put it to a test and then we'll add more. It's already coming to the first code. That's gonna be the Tornado Spin. First code. There you go. That's a Tornado Spin. <laughs> the chicken just Tornado Spin. Come on, keep on going. Here it comes. Check this out. Whoa, damn. So that was a nitro boost, as you guys can see right there. It came to the finish line, so we're gonna add, and we're gonna add more codes. Go on a circle. This is a spin code right here. For him to spin crazy. We're gonna make him turn right. All right, so we're gonna stop it right here. So we're gonna make our own color coding as well. So we're gonna make them zigzag. We ran out of nitro stickers, we're gonna draw it on our own. So um, color codings that we just did, the tornado, the spin. Um, actually, all right, so we're ready to try all these new codes. There you go with the new code. So he's gonna do a tornado right there. That's a tornado spin. He's supposed to turn right, right here. Yup, that worked. Snail dose, that's a snail dose right there. That was a snail dose. Got. I guess a U-turn, the backwards, the Michael Jackson. <laughs> I don't know what that was, but let's continue to the second one. This nitro. There you go, there he goes. That's a spin, there you go. That's not the tornado, that's a spin. And then here he comes. And there you go, he said a stop. 
So he came to a stop, but we just added the finish line already. So that's it. He is done. Finish line. There you go, Ozobot. You were amazing today. So that was it, you guys. You guys see my playground with my Ozobot. This is what it actually looks like. I just removed the chicken from it, but this is the Ozobot bit. So with that, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up, you guys. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment, and catch up on the rest of my content. With that said, you guys, you guys are wonderful and amazing. So um, you guys already know what time it is, so you guys can make um your own playground. Don't forget, you guys will need some colors and some white paper, and uh, obviously you will need the color code. So. This is the color codes right here. But with that, you guys, the video has come to an end. So I'm gonna continue to play with my Ozobot, you guys, as I make more playgrounds. So hopefully you guys um, build your own playgrounds, um, share if you guys like. And with that, um, hopefully you guys enjoy this video. That's another way to entertain yourself in this quarantine time as we're like on the seventh or eighth day and I'm going crazy already. But with that, you guys, thank you so much for watching and you guys already know what time it is. With that said, this is Kid Jeff J signing out until the next time.